hello guys welcome back to my channel in this video we are going to learn how to solve problems involving quadratic equations using the Casey FS number one ES plus second edition scientific calculator in seconds and fast by multiple choice questions all right so ensure you stay to the very end of this video let's bring the calculator down and get started all right so this is the Casey FS Another one ES plus second edition scientific calculator. Now, to begin to solve these questions, we have two questions here to practice with. After solving these two questions with you here, you'll be able to solve other problems you meet involving quadratic equations. Alright, so we are going to focus in this video on how to find the rules of quadratic equation. So let's begin with question one. This is a calculator. Now, we need to go to equation mode guys all right but i usually recommend you should receive the calculator you should clear the calculator to reset you just press shift button 9 for the instructions you press 3 for all press equal to and press equal again so now let's go to equation mode you press this mode button all right so equation is option 5 now we want to solve quadratic equation quadratic equation is a kind of equation in which the highest exponent or power of x is 2 so option 3 is for quadratic equation as you can see we have a x squared plus b s plus c equals 0 so this is for quadratic equation press 3 for it all right so it will bring us this place now we need to impute values for a b and c respectively now since we are starting with question 1 we have the quadratic equation to be 10 x squared plus 10 x minus 8 equals 0. So our a is this term 3 s square of which we are going to take the coefficient of 3 s square here as the actual value for a. So what's the coefficient of 3 s square? Coefficient of 3 s square is what 3? Alright, press equal to as we enter. Coefficient is a number behind the variable or an unknown. Alright, so our b is the term 10x of which we are going to take the coefficient of 10x to be the actual value for our b, what we are going to impute here. So the coefficient of 10x here is about 10. Okay, first we call it, we enter. Then the c is a constant which is negative 8. We impute it, and that's all, guys. Very, very simple. So let's first we call it and get the roots of this quadratic equation. So we have our x1 to be 2 over 3, press the quote again, and our s2 to be negative 4. So these are the two rules for this quadratic equation. It's as simple as this, guys. Alright, so let's solve question 2, and after it will call it a class, very, very easy. Okay, so let's press ac button again to wipe out these values we have already imputed. Okay, so the boxes are now empty. Now, for question 2, we have 5x squared minus 13x equals 6. Okay, firstly, this c is recovered over the equality sign and it will change to negative 6. Alright, so the new equation will now be 5x squared minus 13x minus 6 equals 0. Very, very important, guys. So, the our a, the term here, 5x squared, what is the equation of 5x squared? Is what 5. Okay, then minus 13x. What's the coefficient of minus 13x, which is minus 13, which will be our b. Press equality. Now, remember the constant is now negative 6 because this plus is crossed over the equality sign. Alright, so it's no longer 6, it's now what? Negative 6, press negative 6 for it to enter. Okay, so that's it. Press equality again to begin to find the rules of this quadratic equation. So we have s1 to be 3 and s2 to be 1 minus 2 over 5. So this is basically how you can solve problems involving rules of quadratic equation fast and easily using the Casio FS number one ES plus second edition scientific calculator fast for most joyous questions. So there's something interesting for this video. Let's call it the video here, guys. If you are new to this channel, Make sure you hit the subscribe button now to subscribe to this channel for more of these videos. Also, like, share, and comment on this video. Let me have a few for what I learned from this video. If you seem to have any specific questions asked regarding the things I've talked about here, 
feel free to leave your question at the comment section below and I'm sure to give you a response. Now I click on the screen above and I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to receive once you are done. Just pray shift button now for the instructions. Press 3, press 1, equal to again. So that's it.